Well, Utah Highway Patrol is asking all of us to slow down. Just this week, they say they are seeing more speeders than ever. Apparently, one driver in Cache County didn't listen. He was clocked at 121 miles an hour in a 65 mile an hour mm -hmm. zone. Well, News Special's Alex Cabrero is live in Wellsville tonight. And Alex, I understand that this is not even the worst of it. Yeah, it's tough to believe that going 121 miles an hour isn't the biggest mistake this driver made this morning, Dan and Debbie. Not only was he recklessly zooming along Highway 89 here in Wellsville, but when troopers did a DUI test on him, they were shocked at the number they got back. It could have been way worse. When you've been a state trooper for as long as Phil Rawlinson has, just a little over 17 years, it's safe to say you've seen it all. Quite a bit. But while he was patrolling early Saturday morning in Cache County, he saw something he still can't believe someone was doing. And I could see him coming down the, down the hill through Sardine and it was just passing cars almost like they were standing still. Sure enough, his radar said 121 miles an hour. Usually at that speed, the radar is really making a lot of noise, so we can hear it pretty good. He radioed to Trooper Joshua Priest, who was ahead of him, giving him a heads up. There's a car coming at 121, get ready. Then Rawlinson went after the driver, who eventually stopped. And if his speeding wasn't bad enough, the two troopers noticed the smell of alcohol on the driver. And we could tell, you know, based on his movements, um, he was having a hard time giving us his basic information. Rawlinson had the driver do a field sobriety test, then a breathalyzer. Turns out he was four times the legal limit. So we're just glad that it didn't turn into a crash that we had to show up on. At that speed, most likely a fatal crash. For Trooper Rawlinson, no matter how many DUI speeders he has caught in his career, <laughs> some drivers still do this. We're glad that it ended the way it did because everybody was safe, but in, in reality, he's still putting us in danger. He's putting the public in danger, uh, put himself in quite a bit of danger. That driver who was from Cache County was taken to jail and his Mustang was impounded. Troopers say he told them he was sorry more than 30 times, but this isn't a scenario where you just get off with a warning. Also, Dan and Debbie, this is another example of what troopers have been saying that we all need to slow down because it doesn't matter if you're trying to get somewhere faster if you just don't get there at all. Back to you.